The Royal Bahamas Police Force reporting a relatively quiet night, but officer in charge of the Central Detective Unit, Chief Superintendent Clayton Fernander, emphasized that officers are still out in full force, maintaining law and order across this country. Minister of National Security, the Honorable Dr. Bernard Nottage, and Minister of State, Senator the Honorable Keith Bell, are pleased with the recent reduction in crime. They acknowledge, though, there's still much more work to be done. I am just happy that the strategies that have been adopted by ourselves from a policy perspective and by the Royal Bahamas Police Force appear to be having a positive impact. It's too early for us to jump up and down about it. Although, you know, anytime we can prevent violent crime, can prevent uh, rapes, uh, and definitely then we can uh, not have the loss of life that we've been having for some months, then, you know, we are encouraged. But I don't want to be boasting and jumping up and down about it because, you know, ultimately, these are people who are involved. And, and it's how they are impacted by their surroundings and by their circumstances that very often determine what they do. It is my hope, and with God's grace, um, I think that it's going gonna, it's gonna, it's gonna to continue to diminish. I think that it is a combination of our policies, our strategies, and certainly the work of all law enforcement agencies, the police, immigration, customs, and the like. And so we anticipate uh, uh, a reduction not just in the homicides, but a, the, all of the categories of crime across the board. Okay.